those brave souls that are still with us. Welcome back, everybody. Welcome We're back. playing King's now, Quest. You may have heard some squawking from a few uh, naysayers so in our kingdom. Jack is dead. Clearly, he's not there. That's kind of sad. But proclamations if and you ask me. Aside, this is the way we have always done it in Daventry, and this is the way we will continue to do it. Now, night hopefuls, if you would be so kind as to present your eyes. Oh, hold still. That doesn't count. You didn't take it from the creature. <laughs> he's going to punch. Oh. There's my cheating ass eye. I didn't even get myself. Not sure how that eye fit in the jar in the first place. He seems distressed. I don't know why. It looks as though his pre-order went through. True enough. Do you remember your eye? Oh, yes. It once belonged to a hideous, majestic unicorn. You know, before the proclamation. Congratulations, everybody. We officially accept all the eyes presented. I'll see you in the duels. All right. Moving on to phase two of the tournament. Oh, Mr. Springbottom. What? You're surprised I'm competing in this stuffed animal tournament? You know what? I will make some stories of my own. <laughs> I'll pick up where my last book left off. It was called 31 Ways to Slay a Monster. Sorry, right? Books? What was she like? Ten? I just can't do it, Mr. Springbottom. Yeah, yeah, yeah! Yeah, yeah! Way to go, Gwendolyn. Gwendolyn! I'm sorry, Grandma. Oh, I'll take care of it, dear. I came to tell you your grandfather is ready for you. Run along, go have some adventures. I just try to have your next adventure away from my glass vases, please. Now it's time for my favorite part of the tournament, the duels. <laughs> the duels. You will compete against each other in a duel of strength and a duel of speed, with the winners facing off in a championship duel of wits. The pairings of knights were selected at random, so no complaining. I'm looking at you, Whisper. Any ties <laughs> will be settled in sudden death. The winner, of course, will gain the knight position. The duel of strength will take place at our fantastical and wondrous floating island. And bring your steed to the tournament theater for the duel of speed. Please unveil the tournament ball. I will remain here for <laughs> any questions. Good luck. All right, so let's take a look at this board here. Which did here. you tackle first? The duel of speed or the duel of strength? It's like Acorn versus Manny for speed, but I have to... Oh, of course. I'm against Whisper, who's supposed to be super fast. And in the duel of strength, I'm against Acorn, who's supposed to be super strong. Like, I do not agree with this matchup. There's a portrait of Whisper. Uh, maybe I need to get him to sign it or something. Alright, so let's see what we've got. An eye bell and the portrait of Whisper. Okay. So the floating island we have not been to just yet. Uh, but there are a couple things that I want to take care of here. Uh, which I believe was back this way. So let's swing over this way. Got a big rock. I better stand on this side of the rock. Not strong enough for that one. Need to find something to pry it or something like that. Oh, hello. Huh, what a peculiar trap. Yeah. Well, I can't reach it. But I think it's tied to this tree. Yeah, it sure is. Excellent. All all right. The ladder here. All right, I'll take that. Sugar shrooms. Guess that's all you can do in there. All right. Well, now we've got some meat and sugar shrooms. Now, the sugar shrooms, I know that the baker wants. I don't know what to do with the meat just yet. Oh, 
Why don't we just continue that way and see what's going on? Sorry about that. I had to uh, turn some volumes down. That's what the oh, the floating island. Excellent. Let's go check it out. Oh, it's Triumph. He's caught in a trap. Oh, and there's a cave here. Let's check out this cave. Oh. Okay. Uh, I'll tell you what. I bet I need that blue flame lantern for that. Let's go this way. Oh, hello. Oh, let's see. A Chaka taught us how to shoot. So we're going to have no problems getting across this. Excellent. There's Mr. Fluffy Bottoms or Fluffy Pants or whatever the hell his name was. Which is weird. I have no clue why he'd be there. That one wasn't that bad. Well. Thank you. Unless all goats in Daventry are unicorns, who knows? Oh, can't do anything over there. All right, I guess he's just gonna sit there eating flowers. We are moving on. The fuck? Hello? Hello? Nothing? Alright. What the f Interesting. Oh, you can... You can stop and turn around every once in a while. What the fuck are these things? Well, this is uh, the merchant's wagon. Oh, clear he's clearly right there where you were just walking. <laughs> what the fuck are these things? Oh, goblins. With swiftness or patience. You'll have to wait and see. Patience, huh? Catch a bitch. Alright, we're gonna go, uh... We're gonna go the, the nice route and try not to kill any of them. Because it looks like after you hit them, like they limp away. And you might be able to shoot them again. Oh, see, they're just helping each other out. Hey, buddy. Yeah? Anybody else? Come on. Oh, they're clearly not a threat. Good 360 no scopes, guys. I can't, I can't look around 360, though. Hey, buddy. Fuck out of here. This seems to be kind of an auto aim because it'll draw back toward a target. See, I wasn't moving it there. Oh, nice! I just, I wasn't gonna shoot him at first because I thought that he was fine, but he was picking up that rock to throw at me. Thank the shining spars. Where did you learn to shoot like that? Now I'm not a native from a chaka. But I'm pretty Rip. sure I made out the words unicorns and majestic museum. Mr. Fancy Cakes is too barbarous for a caged life. Listen, I want to sincerely apologize for my pilfering sausages and thank you for saving me. Oh, no problem, bro. I have been through too much already today. I forgive you. And I just want to say... Uh, yeah, 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 that's sweet boy, real nice here. And since we are all square, I have a favor to ask of you. Can you deliver this rare and miraculous ingredient to that amateur magic shop in town? It's a snoozing leaf. Be careful transporting it, though. Once Mr. Fancy Cakes ate one of these snoozing leaves and was knocked out cold for days. And as a token of my appreciation, here is your money back. Oh, thanks, bro. There you go. 
I'd give you more, but those hoarding goblins looted my cart. Well, gotta run. Good thing these shorts breathe so well. Thanks again, boy. <laughs> I won't forget this. Good in In this case, he's, like, pulling his own cart. Ha, the merchant immediately forgot that. All right. Looks like possible care. Okay, no. I think that was probably the only reason to come here. It was that guy up there. Still, I didn't mean to kill him. All right, well, let's go uh, pass this feather along, I suppose. I guess that uh, is a good indication as to why the quote-unquote majestic unicorn is just hanging out there by himself. Hey, buddy. I don't think that's Mr. Fancy Cakes, though. I think Mr. Fancy Cakes had a uh, an eye patch. All right, so we need to figure out how to get the the uh, pumpkin for the lantern. And we'll swing back this way a little later. But since I have a clear objective, which is not a main objective, I don't think, but a clear objective to get this feather back to the magic shop people. We're going to go ahead and take care of that right off the bat. here. Maybe they'll give me uh, something sweet for it. Oh, joy! Graham the Brave is here! Ah, the little boy who wants to do big things. Wow. Congratulations. Why well, I gotta do a little boy? This round of the tournament. Our crystal ball told us about the eye you presented. Wasn't the cleverest way of going about things, was it? You seem like such a nice boy. Hopefully you'll use your noggin a bit more in the future. Oh, but we don't need any more brash knights. Wow, that. guys, really? No matter your Too choice soon. in life, we will gladly take your money. Business is business. Now, Chester, can you hand me the frog's breath elixir? Frog's breath elixir, yes. Uh, where is that? <laughs> uh, we seem to be out of uh, it. <laughs> you drank it all again, didn't you? Muriel, my blood sugar was low. <laughs> <laughs> it's just so tasty. Since you can't keep your mitts off our supplies, we are halting production. This potion will have to wait until that merchant brings us our delivery. If you find a frog, bring it directly to me, and I will gladly trade you a sample of this potion. A frog, huh? Then I'll have to drink the delicious froggy leftovers. Until then, no more free dips. Wow, I can't. Okay. Fuck you guys then. Anyway, oh, here's this. Yes, finally here. Well. Part of it, anyway. Chester, remind me to leave a poor review for that merchant on the town board. Ah, this should do the trick. Mm. It's close, but it still needs that frog's breath. Well, I'm glad I could help further it along. Yes. Frog's breath. As a token of our appreciation, we would like to give you this, this, um, this, this vial of hypnotic powder. Oh. It's expired. Expired. It can work. Why does everything in this place suck? Let me guess. In the shop. It's all, you know, tears. expired. I can bring you a tub to Mr. Fancy Cakes for. Nope. It just needs raisins. Yeah. Thanks. I guess. Well, all right. Okay, so we need to f get that pumpkin. So let's go uh, work on getting that pumpkin. So we can get the lantern. 
and then we can you know go through um, that cave Still there. I have to get these old picks before I can go home. Leave me be so I can finish my work. Fine. All right, pumpkin. Oh, we still got squirrels. That pumpkin was housing too many squirrels for my taste. All right. Well. Tell you what, we'll get to that later then. Let's go uh let's go check out the duel of speed. I wonder if there's anything we can do with this. Is it I mean it lets me interact with it? So let's see. Oh maybe uh There we go. Ew, gross. <laughs> All right, then. We got a badger. Okay, so remember, at the beginning, when we first got to the town, the badger was chasing the squirrel around? I have a thought, guys. That is how we're going to get that pumpkin. Let's see. Let's try to use a badger right here. Aha! Squirrels remember that? The squirrels will most certainly remember that. Well, fuck them. They wouldn't let me have what I needed, you know? <laughs> Alright, let's go get us a blue lantern. Is he still over here? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm not sure if he'll actually ever finish and leave. Finally gonna get us the lantern that she was talking. Remember, uh, Amara was talking about the lantern always breaking. Maybe it won't break if it's in a a different housing. Also, remember that the lantern is the only thing that the wolves are scared of. Now, give us one shiny gold coin, and the beautiful blue flame lantern will be all yours. Alright, but it's my last coin. Thanks, dearie. And here's your lovely pumpkin lantern with a glowing blue flame candle. Thanks. 